Hello and welcome to another video. In this one we're going to be drawing circles. Sometimes your little compass here is not big enough to draw a big circle or maybe you don't even have a compass at all. So let's make one. And first off we're going to need a stick. About a 10 by 10 millimeters is what I'm going to use and as long as you need. I'm going to take about 20 or 30 centimeters roughly of stick and cut it off with a saw blade. Now I'm going to take a small nail that's going to go through the stick and poke out the other side so that's going to be my pivot point for the compass. With the hammer, nail it through. So there it is, it's going to pivot on that point and if it's not very sharp you can file it with a file just to make sure it's got a good point. The next thing to do is to take the smaller stick and cut a V in that where the pencil is going to sit with the saw. Now the way this is going to work, we move down the stick some and that stick is going to go there the pencil is going to go between there and then it's going to clamp on there so that it will now move. Now we need to make the clamp. The quickest and easiest way that I have found is to take a stick like this and place the other sticks on there a little bit in from the end and draw a couple of lines there and then we're going to cut a piece there so that we're going to get a notch out of that. And then clean it up with a knife or a chisel or something to get that more or less flat. and cut that off. Right, to use it you're going to basically take the two sticks and put them together, put your pencil into the slot there, and then down further you're going to get your clampy thing, put it on, and then slide it up. And then you can, while it's looser, you can lift off the tension by pulling it back down a bit. And then you can measure, adjust that, get it to the right distance you need it, and then push it up to clamp it shut. And now you're ready to go. Now if you don't have a piece of wood on hand to do that, you can use some of the same stick and cut a couple of pieces off of the side pieces and put one across, one across here with, a couple, with some nails through there as a provisional thing. That will work okay. Now an improvement on that is that because of the distances here, sometimes those might snap off. So you can take a thin piece of wood like this and cut a piece and nail it on there and glue it so you're going to get something like this and of course that won't come off it just it stays on there it's like a wooden ring so that's quite nice another way to do that would be to make it out of a whole block cut a square hole that would be stronger so that there's don't have those joints there that can come apart and even i think the quickest and easiest is probably use piece of the stick there and two pieces sandwiched together so that they are thinner than the other one so that it's a little bit more sleek and uh, more professional. There was one last little detail I would put a little nail here, here and at this end here so we have little stoppers that so that it won't come off and at the other end also and the sticks won't come apart so you can hang it on a hook and keep it for another day.